My name is Dr. Augustine from Ahead to Wellness. Are you interested in your heart and how it's functioning? Heart rate variability is a specialized EKG technology developed and used in cardiovascular research as a predictor of sudden cardiac death. As far as health screenings are concerned, doctors are interested in blood pressure, blood sugar, and usually cholesterol. What about the most important system that controls all of these? Yes, that's right, the nervous system. Controls and coordinates all organ systems and cells in the body. Wouldn't it be better to check the controlling system of blood pressure, blood sugar, and cholesterol? The master controller of all bodily functions, and specifically what heals the body, is the autonomic nervous system. I use heart, heart rate variability to discover hidden health problems. If the nervous system is not controlling the body well, then anything can go wrong. If the nervous system is not functioning well, then the body cannot function well. An advanced testing procedure that's not invasive, but can provide some vital information, such as how the heart's functioning, how the special autonomic nervous system is functioning, and it also provides a very accurate health marker. Don't be fooled. True HRV is based upon electrical conductivity of heart muscle, not your pulse. The space between each blip on your EKG is stacked vertically, creating the blue band which represents heart function. The blue band shown above should be very bumpy for excellent heart function, while a flat blue band represents poor heart function. The autonomic or automatic nervous system has two parts. The sympathetic or stress nervous system, which is the vertical line. The stress nervous system is worse when your findings are higher up on the scale. The horizontal line with the yellow and red arrows represents the parasympathetic nervous system, which relaxes you, decreases blood pressure, is most active during the night, and is what heals your body. Moving left on the horizontal line would be poor or bad nerve system function, Moving to the right on the horizontal line would be good or great nerve system function. The center indicates balance in the nervous system. The health marker is simple. The top left of the colored box is the best health and the bottom right is the worst health. The interesting thing about this exam is that the foundation of health and wellness is the nervous system. This exam proves it. Never does any component of this exam disagree with the others. You cannot have good heart function and poor nerve system function. The nerve system is what creates good heart function and good health. This is the first page of the exam which shows heart function. The more bumpy the better, your heart is functioning. The autonomic nerve system, which is the bottom right, which drives heart function, is the vertical and horizontal lines. The stress nerve system is the vertical line, and the healing nerve system is the horizontal line. The second page of the exam shows you the health marker, the middle right side of the page, which here is a white box. Again, the top left is the best health, while the bottom right corner is the worst. Additionally, towards the bottom left side, there's an explanation of heart function and vascular reaction when you stand up. Finally, there's a couple of numbers, laying down and standing up, which are located in the bottom left corner. The higher those numbers are, the better. Back on the first page of the exam, we're looking at the zones where your autonomic nervous system is at. The top left of the autonomic nervous system is where people are clinically, meaning they have problems or health challenges. The bottom left zone is reserved for those people who are near death's door. I've done scans on many people who are at the bottom left corner, and these are the people who've had cancer, strokes, chronic illness like diabetes and autoimmune diseases. The important point here is the more disconnected you are from your nervous system, the more health problems you'll have.
Here's more explanation about the autonomic nervous system. I'm very focused on the horizontal line because the parasympathetic nervous system is where healing comes from. The further right you go, the healthier you become. The further left you go, the more unhealthy you are. A minus one is mild nerve disturbance. Minus two is moderate. Minus three and beyond is severe nerve disturbance. An important consideration is the further left you go, the more effort you have to make to improve your health and the longer it takes to recover your health. My name is Dr. Augustine. If you have any questions or comments, please contact me at 562-860-3404 or by email at drjim at aheadtowellness.com. Thanks for watching.